is about teaching kids how to grow and harvest their own food and then how to cook delicious nutritious meals with that food. And what are you doing here? Uh, right now we are I'm digging the holes because tomorrow we are going to plant a whole lot of feed joa trees and lemon trees and lime trees so that we've got more fruit for our school. Sounds amazing. Thanks. I value the children. The children are the best part of Waterbury School. They are so friendly and kind and hard workers. What is this behind you? So, so this behind us is an example of our writing that we've been doing. This is a, a piece of writing based on the BFG. It's a piece of creative writing. And up the top here is some artwork that we've been doing based on a, an American artist called Kimmy Cantrell. So we've been in lots of artwork, as you can see, our class is full of artwork at the moment and busy beavers completing their artwork. Uh, so lots of art, uh, we've been doing lots of math, we've been learning our times tables and learning about fractions and we've been doing some narrative writing as well. These are the chickens. This is 
Christmas to King, our principal. What are, you, what are the unique things about our Episcopal? Uh, many unique things, I'd say. Uh, I think the Garden to Table program, our gully, our natural environment, and the kids are all pretty unique here. Um, and we all know how to have lots of fun and do lots of exciting things. And what do you like about our Episcopal? All the people. Um, we've got a great community, everyone gets on very well and kids know how to have fun and get on with one another and um, challenge themselves. This is Carissa, our International Manager and ESOL teacher. So what is ESOL? So ESOL is where I get the international students on a one-on-one -on -one basis and I teach them for 50 minutes about English and we do reading, writing, speaking and listening. And we also help to integrate them into the mainstream classrooms. What's your favourite thing about being an international teacher? I love all the different cultures and what the children's unique um, culture brings to us, as well as us teaching them about New Zealand life and uh, their personalities and how they fit in and adapt. Thank you.